AI and SaaS businesses are a hot topic these days. Before has been the year of AI, but I'd be happy that we're a little bit scared of this. Along with space, along with AI, we are tracking the development of robotics. And the good news for smart entrepreneurs like you is that this creates a once in a lifetime opportunity. Listen, AI has the potential to transform the world completely, and I'm here to tell you how to profit from this opportunity. And for context, I'm Alex Berman, and I ran a lead gen company that scaled to a million dollars a month in revenue. I've published several books about business growth, and I've taken in companies to the Inc. 5000, fastest growing companies in the world, multiple times in a row. So when I talk about opportunities, you might want to pay attention and take notes. If you've been thinking of starting your entrepreneurship journey, creating the next big startup, building a unicorn company, or making millions of dollars, then you're in the right video. This could easily be your starting point on this success path, so make sure to stay with me till the end. I'm already taking advantage of some of these AI SaaS business opportunities to make some more millions. For example, with my software company, Gallup. Anyway, we'll review five totally new, innovative, yet simple AI SaaS businesses with massive potential that you can start right now. So make sure to watch the full video. Let's begin. The first is Remote Team Culture Builder. I told you these aren't traditional ideas. If you work in a remote environment, you know how challenging it is to build and maintain a strong, high-performance, motivated company culture. And if you don't work in this, you're like, what are you talking about, company culture? Well, an old company I used to work for said their trick to improving company culture is just buy some ping pong tables and let people go at it. And maybe that's part of it, but company culture is more than just going out for drinks with the team or playing some ping pong or taking them on company retreats. Culture is that thing that drives your team forward. It's what stops people from giving less than 100%. If somebody delivers crappy work and everyone ruthlessly mocks them so that they want to deliver higher quality work next time, that is a good company culture. If somebody delivers bad quality work and everyone celebrates it, then that's terrible company culture because now they're going to deliver less work over time. So what I would do is build a SaaS tool that helps remote teams plan, schedule, and organize virtual events and team building activities. And you can use AI to do this. You can put it inside your team Slack, whatever. And what it would basically do is force your team members to get to know each other. Whether that is doing quiz games all at the same time on a Zoom meeting, or it's asking engaging questions every week, that would encourage teams to engage together. One of the biggest issues with these remote companies that we're building is it's very hard to have off-topic conversations. They're on the Zoom calls. They're talking about the work that needs to get done, and there's no time to talk about how the kids are doing or how the soccer game went that everybody likes. Is it the World Cup? I don't, I don't 100% that know what's going on, but they want to talk about that. And so build a little team builder thing that helps them become closer friends. Then they'll be more patient with each other, deliver higher quality work, and the company that you're selling into will make more money. That's it. Easy peasy. Just imagine a platform where remote teams can bond just as effectively as in person teams. Not too bad. If you can increase productivity, then teams will be willing to pay thousands of dollars for that. Now let's move on to another equally exciting idea, a micro learning platform for professionals. And I'm not just talking about another online course library, although you could see Sam Ovens and Alex Ramosi just partnered on School, which is kind of like a clone of Teachable, just an on online course platform, community platform. But I'm thinking instead of an online course library of who knows what, this would be a tactical platform filled with standard operating procedures rather than all of these hour long courses. So instead of paying for the latest Ty Lopez course or the latest course from that random Dubai guru, you would instead get real checklists from actual companies. And so as the business owner, you'd go out and collect these checklists. Like how does Amazon do their customer service onboarding? And then you would be able to take that as the customer of this business and just follow it step by step without having to go through all these online courses by people that may or may not be qualified. Usually they're not. It would offer bite-sized learning modules on all these different topics, allowing the busy professional to upscale quickly without having to watch all of these YouTube videos. It'd be perfect for all those people that have no time, but a lot to learn. And since the total address market is huge, the potential to grow a business here is uncapped. And speaking of a huge total addressable market, here's another wild idea. But first, if you're an agency owner, business owner, or founder who wants to build a legit business where you can charge ten dollars to $30,000 per client, I have something for you. 
in the description below. You can book a free consulting call with one of our coaches that has done $10 million plus in sales and ask them anything about your business. We usually charge $500 for this consulting call, but for a limited time, it's free for our YouTube audience. Check the first link in the description and book your free consulting call now. So the third idea is to build a virtual interior design assistant. This platform would allow users to design and furnish their homes virtually using AI powered design recommendations and augmented reality. Just for some context, my wife has a degree in interior design. And when I told her about this and showed her what some of the AI startups in the space are doing, she decided to give up that entire career and start working on something else. AI has replaced a lot of what these designers do. Like, hey, you should put a couch over here and this painting over here. Now a human doesn't have to tell you that. Now an AI can tell you, and it's better than what humans are coming up with. Picture yourself designing your dream home in minutes and getting real augmented reality previews. Maybe you import some photos from Google or Pinterest, you show the AI what you like, and then it gives you the exact style that you're looking for. Whether you're looking for that super modern Elon Musk sort of Tesla bot look, or you want that adventurer Indiana Jones style look, whatever, the AI will generate whatever you need. I feel like I got the Indiana Jones dream, but that minimalist budget, if you know what I'm saying. So basically it would tell you what to buy. And if you could integrate that with real product recommendations. So instead of just showing you a picture of what your home could look like, if it would actually recommend, hey, buy this couch for 3000 bucks and here's an affiliate link, buy this lamp from Amazon, it's 200 bucks, here's an affiliate link, then you have the opportunity to even make the product free or very cheap and make all of that money on the back end. That's what a lot of real interior designers will do. They'll come to your house for free and basically tell you what to buy. And then you buy it from them and they make the profit that way. So there is the opportunity to do this free as well. And the customers that are redesigning their house by definition have major budgets. You're gonna spend 30,000 on furniture. You can spend a couple hundred bucks to get this design perfect first. Easy, as they say, peasy, blended squeezy. How much would you be willing to pay for something like this? If you plan to redesign your house, it's a lot. So that's why this is a great opportunity. It would be like having a personal interior designer available 24 seven at an insignificant fraction of the actual cost. Now let's tackle the next million dollar idea. AI spreadsheet assistance. Spreadsheets can be a big pain, especially when you're talking about complex formulas. I mean, I am in the lead gen cold email space. So I am used to spreadsheets that are thousands, if not hundreds of thousands of rows long, where we have to do things like split a name into two different columns or use AI to write a custom first line, which used to have to be done by a human or even use an AI agent to find LinkedIn information from a person, et cetera. There's a ton of stuff that AI can do to a spreadsheet that was not possible even a year ago. And so if you can build a spreadsheet program like that with a specific use case in mind, there's a chance you could make a lot of money as well. My background's all in lead generation, so I give you a bunch of lead generation use cases for that. But I'm sure if you think about what your background is, whether it's commercial real estate, or maybe you're an electrician, or maybe you're an agency owner, you can think of a bunch of ways that you can add AI on top of your Google Sheets and give you new information that you wouldn't be able to get before. Even things just like splitting names in two, AI is much better at that. Or verifying information. There are AI agents that will Google things for you. So for instance, if I get a lead and it's like Alex Berman from Galanon, then we can have the AI agent inside of your spreadsheet, search Alex Berman Galanon and find my LinkedIn. Or search Alex Berman Galanon and see that I don't work there and then say, oh, this is the wrong lead because the new founder of Galadon or the new marketing guy at Galadon is this guy instead. And you should reach out to this guy. That's all possible with AI. If you can think of a job for a human, now pretty much AI is able to do that. So use this business idea to just add a layer of AI to a spreadsheet, charge money for it. You're good to go. I'm thinking it's an AI plugin where you only describe what you want the spreadsheet to do in plain English. And then the AI would translate it into whatever the complex formula that you need. That'd be a lifesaver for anyone working with a lot of data, and it would drastically improve productivity for big companies, which would make the AI plugin very valuable. Now, let's talk about a very interesting idea in the field of finance. I'm talking AI-powered personal finance assistant. This platform would use AI to provide personalized financial advice, budget tracking, and expense optimization. It would be like having a Harvard graduated financial advisor in your pocket, helping you make better financial decisions effortlessly. So what I'm imagining is you download a bunch of PDFs of your bank statements, your stock holdings, et cetera. You shove it into this AI. Then you as the founder of this AI have created a personal finance prompt. And then it basically spits back your recommendations. Like, oh, you don't have enough in your emergency fund, but you have way too much in stocks. 
So you should sell some of your stocks and hold it in cash in case there's an emergency. Or the opposite. You have way too much in your emergency fund and not enough in stocks. So you should take that money from your emergency fund and buy some dollar sign VU with that. VU is an index fund, by the way. It's where I hold the majority of my cash that's not in an emergency fund or deployed to our portfolio of businesses, aka when I'm not burning it on business investments. So this personal finance assistant would take all of your data that you upload and give you real recommendations. And if you wanted to, you could even base the recommendations off of the books of giant personal finance names. Like take your total money makeover, Dave Ramsey, throw it in there. Take your I will teach you to be rich, Ramit Sethi, throw that in there and maybe let the user pick. I would rather have Graham Stephan give me his recommendation or Mr. Wonderful from Shark Tank give me his recommendation, etc. Or even Tony Robbins money. So your personal financial advisor now is trained directly on these books and your exact personal situation. Then combining them together, AI gives you a good piece of advice and you're able to grow from there. Sounds valuable enough. It'd be like having a Harvard graduated financial advisor in your pocket helping you make better financial decisions after this. Sound interesting, right? You could give it a shot. But in the meantime, as a bonus, let's talk about another innovative AI idea in the customer service industry. And by the way, if you're enjoying this video so far, please make sure to give it a like. It helps us to know if we're creating the right type of content. Thank you. This is an AI powered customer service chatbot. Great business idea, great business opportunity because everyone has customers with questions. Every business has customers constantly asking questions, 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 questions. And AI is a great way to have those questions answered. This is very similar to what we're doing with Galadon with our sales focused chatbot where we're trained in B2B sales, you know, bank questions, those kind of selling techniques, you can train your customer service chatbot on whatever formulas you want, you know, create the ultimate customer service chatbot for residential real estate. Maybe it takes all the maintenance requests and helps itemize them for the backend maintenance team. You can also create the ultimate chatbot for SaaS customer onboarding, where basically it'll train exactly on how to use your SaaS or your customer SaaS and teach them how to use it in the app so that they can stop asking all these questions to the people on your team. It would be like having a dedicated customer service rep working around the clock, ensuring that these companies' customers always get a proper and timely response. But anyway, very important to recap what we've covered so far, we reviewed opportunities like the remote team culture builder, micro learning platform for professionals, the virtual interior design assistant, the AI spreadsheet assistant, the AI powered personal finance assistant, and the bonus idea was the AI powered customer service chatbot. Each of these AI SaaS business ideas has the potential to be the next big startup of the world, so make sure to take action now. And if you're still here, congratulations. In the next three seconds, I'll recommend another video to help your business thrive. Go watch that next video now. I'll see you there. Bye.